Hello, it's Nancy today. I am going to make a sundial today. I am. Yes, a big one. Now I have here my labyrinth. This is Everfar Labyrinth. Now, I was going to make it in the center of this, but you know, I think it's going to bang me in the face if I do it there. Well, <clears throat> now, a sundial, you don't need a circle for a sundial. You need half a circle because the sun is only up for half of the, the 24 hours. It's not going to rotate all the way around your sundial. It's only going to go from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. or whatever those numbers are. Now, um, depending on where you live, um, whatever your latitude is, how far north you are, that's, how, that's the angle for your sundial. Okay, so let's, maybe, I don't know exactly what I'm doing here yet. I never really know what I'm doing. Okay, so if I were to put it, move this out of the way, it doesn't go here. Okay, so here's my labyrinth. This is a good post, isn't it? This one would do well. And if I can pound it into the ground, and it will make a shadow. Now, since I live at 45 degrees latitude, 45 degrees latitude is a very easy angle to make. You take a piece of paper, and you fold it in the corner. You must make sure you fold the corner properly. Listen to that warbler, that's a new one. I haven't heard that one. To find him. Oh, he's up in the top of the tree up there. No, he's not. He's somewhere else. I'll find him with the other camera. Pretty song, isn't it? Da 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 da. -da. Okay, so da 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 da. -da. This is my um, 45 degree angle. I folded my paper over. Maybe. Well, maybe we'll just have a practice one. Now, my angle is going to be the angle at which this is sticking into the ground, okay? And it needs to be facing south. So, let's see. My house, the corners are at north, south, east, and west. So, this right here is south. Now, oh, I have a black fly. So now, if I pound this into the ground at this angle, that will be my sundial. Okay, let's... Where do we do it? Should I do it in the middle? The middle is such a good place, but I have this post in the middle. Maybe this should just go... I don't know. See, I've already got something in the middle here. It won't really work. Unless I remove that from the middle. What about this? Is that at 40? Maybe I should do it so that that will be at 45 degrees angle. Let's see what the angle is already. Oh, down at the ground. See, it's not 45. But if I tilt it... Okay, let's see if we can lift this out of the ground. Okay. And now, let's see if we can plant it back in the ground at 45 degree angle. So, on this angle, with the camera in my hand, and so it's going to have to go at something like that for an angle at the bottom. I'll have some grass here. Ta -da. <laughs> Our soil is all sand.
Okay, so if I put this in, uh, it's going to go something like that. And let us check our angle. It needs to go a little further this way. Okay, so I think that's pretty good 45 degree angle there. Now it needs to point from south. So it needs to turn a little more. Like so. Okay. Where'd my paper go? Let's check our angle again. forward just a little bit. Okay, that's good. And now it's facing from the south. Okay, so this is my sundial. facing west. Now I could actually stick something into here and make it longer. That messes up my angle a little bit. Okay, now what I'll need to do, it is just about 8 o'clock in the morning. So I need to mark where the sun hits at 8 o'clock in the morning. We have one minute, actually I have two minutes. So they don't cut you off until you get to 11. Okay, so for 8 o'clock in the morning, we are going to mark where it hits with this conch shell. Remember when I got this shell from the dump? I told you it would be good for marking a sundial. Okay, so let's see where it's hitting. The sun right now is over there such as it is and so the sun is more is the shadow should come it's not very sunny the shadow should come to about right there for eight o'clock in the morning and we'll have to wait until we get some sunshine on it to be sure
I could put this conch standing on its end. This is not a real conch. It's not because, as you can see, this is created by an artist. Atlantic at mold, or Atlantic mold. And see, it has nice feet on it. Conch shells don't come with feet. Well, I'm glad I found the sun when it was there, because that's about eight o'clock. From the, I put it from the post. Okay, goodbye.